Hey guys, it's Diamond, and today I'm here to tell you guys like a quick little story time about the first time I got drunk. So, I feel like people, when they have like these first night they get drunk stories, it's like, oh yeah, I went out to a party and they just passed me a cup and then I just woke up the next day and I remember or something. And my first time drinking story is just not like that. Like, it's really crazy. So anyway, let's just get right into it. So, um, I didn't, I do not promote underage drinking, under the legal age of drinking, whatever. I don't know if I have to put that disclaimer in there. I just don't want YouTube to clock me. So anyway, um, I never drank when I was younger at all. A lot of my friends drank and I just never drank. People used to always refer to me as the most sober turn the most turn sober person that they know people would tell me that all the time so i didn't start drinking until i was already after 18 like never drank so one day after having like a little get together at my house i had so much alcohol left over at my house like it was all in the fridge there was fucking thought juices the lime maritas the little thought burritos or whatever there was like red apple ale and i think some other stuff i don't really know what was all in there but there was a bunch of stuff in the fridge so i'm like okay i'm literally at home on an off day i used to work a nine to five i'm literally at home i just decided i wanted to drink so there was a six pack of lime marita thought strawberry burritos whatever the hell they're called it however the hell you say them so there's like a six pack. So I'm like, okay, I'm going to drink all this alcohol until I feel like I'm drunk. Like I want to see what it is. Oh, what's up? Can a nigga just keep in touch? So I'm like, okay, boom. So I go knock back these strawberry margaritas. Like it's nothing. Knock them back. Six. Done. 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 It's gone. Um, I'm in my room. I'm in my home by myself. Okay by myself getting turned off these lime maritas drinking them like i said those six are gone i think there was like three red apple l's i'm drinking those and whatever else was there i'm literally like let me get rid of this alcohol let me just go ahead and drink this shit so i'm just knocking this shit back i end up getting on facetime i don't know what span of time this was i don't know how long it took but i end up getting on facetime with someone i was talking to at the time and I'm just drunk as hell just like well what do you do when you're drunk I don't know what to do I don't know what I do because I've never been drunk before just being a complete idiot just doing all this talking and I'm still drinking at that so they tell me that I need to get some bread and I need to like take a shower blah 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 so watch peep this this is such a fast story but I just wanted to like share it with you guys like I said, knocked back six, the whole six pack of the lime maritas, some red apple ale, blah, blah, blah. So when they tell me that I need to get bread, I go in the kitchen, I get the, the loaf of bread, come back. I'm sitting on the floor at this point. I'm sitting on the floor, trying to eat the bread, trying to sober up. I'm like, okay, you know, I was drunk. It was cool for a minute. Now I'm ready to be not drunk no more, bitch. I'm ready to be sober. It was cool, it was cute, okay, I'm feeling it, but now I'm ready to be sober. So I'm on the floor, laying on the floor. I'm like, okay, let me, I'm putting in the shower. I turn on the shower water, go back on the floor, get back to eating the bread. Then I'm like, okay, I gotta take my clothes off. Take my clothes off, strip down completely naked, and I'm still holding the bread, and I fall asleep. On FaceTime, they didn't like, you know, of course they couldn't see me, they could see my face naked on FaceTime on the floor with a loaf of bread with all the lights on and the water running in the bathroom and I wake up later on and I'm just throwing up the most horrible thing ever and honestly I would have been fine because I get way drunker than that now I would have been fine but those red apple ales fucked my fucking stomach up so everything would have been cool but I think the fact that I was drinking it so fast and the red apple ale just <clears throat> I can just remember it it was terrible when I laid down I was so dizzy that I would just get up and just try to breathe and I just kept throwing up and oh 
yeah it was pretty terrible but in my mind it was cool and when people when i tell people this they're like what the fuck like what is wrong with you but in my mind it was cool because i was like look so this is my thoughts take a step into my mind really fast if i get drunk at home i will know my limits versus if i'm just out with my friends and i try to drink i'm not really gonna know what my limits are and i might get too fucked up in public and make an ass of myself and embarrass myself so i was like you know what i'm gonna try it at home at least i'm home nothing can happen because i'm at home so it's okay so that was my thoughts about it but i was never a drinker i didn't drink or anything in high school not until i actually moved out into my own house and stuff so yeah, just like a really quick story. I don't even know if I would count this as a story time. I don't even know what to call this. But the first time I got drunk, I was by myself in my apartment drinking that Aritas. <laughs> Side note, I need, I want to come up with a new word for these kind of videos where it's not like a story time because it's not really like a dramatic story, but I'm just kind of telling you guys about something that happened. So if you guys have a suggestion of a name or something that I can call it, like it's not really a story time, like this is not like a 15 minute story or 30 minute story. It's just like a little five minute, this happened to me and it was funny. If you have suggestions on what to call those kind of videos, leave it down in the description box. And yeah, if you like these like short, like little funny story videos, also let me know in the, in the comment section as well. And don't forget to like, comment and subscribe and I'll see you guys next time. Bye.